plants that you're seeing right behind me, they're all indigenous to this local area and they're very important to, you know, keep the ecosystem uh, alive. All of this being uh, put on by the uh, Virginia Native Plant uh, Society and we have the local chapter president, Steve Stasul, is still with us this morning. So, you know, we've learned a lot about the plants, how important they are. But tell us, the money that's raised, where does that go to? We've donated plants and money to some of the uh, local areas, the Lynn Haven River Now, Chesapeake Bay Foundation, Elizabeth River Project. We put in uh, $1,000 to set some shade trees over at uh, Paradise Creek over in Portsmouth. So a lot so, of uh, beautification projects and everything. Yes. So it's not just going to one central uh, location. But uh, tell us, for those that you know are watching, maybe they want to get a hand, their hands on an indigenous plant, but they're not able to make it. Are they able to find these plants elsewhere? Are you guys able to like ship plants out to them? There, there's actually a couple of, of uh, nurseries locally that do sell native plants. Lady Fern over on Collie Avenue in Norfolk. Uh, Nicole used to actually run our plant sale and now she has her own plant store. Uh, Southern Branch in Chesapeake also also sells native plants. There are other plant uh, nurseries that you can find on the Virginia Native Plant Society website, the state website. They have a list of nurseries that sell them. And right now, what are the chances of these plants being sold out? Two years ago, we sold out by two o'clock in the afternoon. Mm. And we didn't have as many plants for that sale as we've done for this sale. Uh, this sale, we price our plants to, to go to a nice home. And, you know, for that reason, if you compare what we have in the big box stores, some of their plants may look a little bit prettier right now. A lot of our plants, they're not going to bloom for a few weeks or maybe not until, say, June, July, August. So you've got plants that could bloom any time of the year, but plus, they're a great value. And plus all the plants that you get, you see here, all of them are going to local causes, good efforts to just beautify uh, the local region. And of course, if you go to WTKR.com right now, we have all of that information uh, for you. Make sure to wear a face mask though if you're, cover, uh, if you're coming here. They're also encouraging social distancing uh, as well. But it starts at nine o'clock here at the Lynn Haven House.